In 30 days, Rudy about to make 10,000 three-point shots. 10,000. I guarantee none of y'all have made 10,000 threes in a month. Oh my God. Oh my. Okay, change direction however you want. When we, ch when we dr get into our drive, you can go one or two dribbles, but you're gonna work on skipping and finishing. So we're skipping now off the inside foot. All right, skipping off the inside foot. When you land now, outside, inside, you're here, skip. Outside, inside, you have a window finish here. You have a floater here. Or if you land the opposite way, you can shoot it where you push back. So I'm gonna give you three looks. First look can be here where we skip and we go window finish. That's look number one. That's one finish you can work on. Another finish you can work on. Skip, outside, inside, floater. It's the second one you can work on. All right, and then the third one is a skip, land on two, and then go a little control fade with a jump shot. All right, so those are the three that you can work on. If you, if you shoot a lot of floaters, get into floaters, mix it up. All right, finish at the rim a lot, get to the rim. If you, if you are comfortable shooting a little control fade, shoot the control fade. So any change of direction I want, I got two bounces, land on two, get out. AJ, let me see one of those real quick. Good, hit. Not bad, solid, good. That was a transition, I like it. Tough. You won? You won. Huh? I just kept going, yeah. The timing of two of uh I don't care what y'all do, you can dribble as much as you want. I want to see something crazy. You ready? Rock out. I like it. I like it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. let's get a rating going on. That's like a six, right? Six? Yeah, one to ten. I go six, go rock. Oh my God. Oh my. That's a nine, bro. That's tough. No, oh, one more. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh my gosh. Oh. Now listen, hold the ball. I like when you, you this is good for y'all if you, if you understand, hey, you're not gonna be going in the game and start doing this, right? No. You're not gonna start dribbling around like crazy in a game, but at the same time, this stuff, when you're training, you can do this a little bit because it's gonna make you confident and comfortable with the ball. Because I know you can do all that, most likely you're gonna have a handle in the game. But in a game, you're not gonna take eight, nine dribbles, right? It's more efficient. It's more efficient. So as long as you guys can distinguish between the two, right? If you're gonna work on freestyling and work on your handle and work on mixing up moves, perfectly fine. But no, in a game, your coach is not going to let you go and start dribbling around with your head down. It's not, the, it's not basketball, right? So while we're having fun right now and mixing it up, that's good. But know that in a game, you got to condense it a little bit. Correct? All right, that's going to be impo an important concept. But you can work on this stuff. This is fine that you're working on it. All right, I don't even know what move you just did. That was crazy. You going to do that in the game, though? You might, you would probably. Let's right, switch sides and go again. Quick, quick, quick. Oh, How we feeling? Try to let you guys have some fun there. All right. Um, when you guys are working on your game, remember, you gotta, we gotta be planned. You gotta plan out your, your schedule. You gotta plan out what you think you need to get better at. All right. Who wants to share one of their weaknesses right now? Who wants to share a weakness that they need to improve on? Raise your hand. My three, point shot. three point shooting. Good. What's your name? Rudy. Rudy. Rudy needs to work on his three point shooting. Rudy, how can you fix your three point shot? Rudy, how can you fix your three point shot? Uh, that's just get every day and 
Is the, what did we talk about yesterday? Smart. What? Smart. smart. What's the first acronym in SMART? Specific. specific. Rudy, we got to be specific, bro. Guys, listen. Rudy, we got to be specific. All right? So going to the gym every day is not being specific. What days of the week are you going to the gym to work on your three-point shot? Let's call it, let's go five days a week. What days, though? What days? Good. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Rudy needs to work on his three-point shot. What time? At 2. At 2 o'clock. Rudy, what gym are you going to? LA Fitness. LA Fitness. Where? Jersey. So Rudy, um, from Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, is going to LA Fitness at 3 p.m. Rudy, how many shots are you going to get up? 500 a day? All right, that's a lot. Now, Rudy, let's talk about it because one of the things with, when, when you set goals is they have to be attainable and relevant, right? So, Rudy, you're going to LA Fitness. Are there going to be open gym games going on at LA Fitness? No, but sometimes there are. You're going to have a basket to yourself? Are, is it doable to make 500 shots every day? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, yes? All right, great. So now Rudy's setting his schedule up. Y'all hear this? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday at 3 o'clock, Rudy's going to make 500 three-point shots. Rudy, how long are you going to do that for? Uh, no, let's talk about the time frame. How many months? How many days? Month. One month. So for four weeks. You hearing this? Y'all hear this? For four weeks, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday at 3 p.m., Rudy's going to make 500 jump shots for four weeks. All right, that's 20 days, 500 shots a day. How many shots is that? 2,000. What? 2,000 in one month. Nope. 500 a day. In a month? Yep. 10,000. So now in third, guess what Rudy's going to have the ability to do? I know what you, I know what you did. I said the same thing in my head. You know what, you know what, uh, what Rudy's going to do now? In 30 days, Rudy about to make 10,000 three-point shots. 10,000. I guarantee none of y'all have made 10,000 threes in a month. Guaranteed. So what do you think is going to happen to Rudy's three-point shot if he, if, he, if he decides to make 10,000 shots in the next 30 days? What's going to happen, you think? His shot, his three-point shot is most likely going to get better. So in 30 days, Rudy probably is going to be a better three-point shooter. But the reason, it, Rudy, the reason it happened is because you set up your schedule. In the beginning, you're like, I want to be a three, better three-point shooter. Rudy, what are you going to do? I'm going to go to the gym every day and work on my three-point shot. That doesn't cut it. It needs to be specific. I need to go to the, a specific gym at a specific time and, hit it, and shoot a specific amount of shots. And if I can stick with my schedule and do it for a certain amount of time, then I'm almost guaranteed to get better. Specific. Got it? If you guys start doing that, I promise every single player in here right now, you're all going to get better. You're all going to get better. Got me?